Hello, music tech people. So the first part of this assignment is going to be rhythm warm up. We just need to get the rhythms going, get us practicing, feeling the beat. Okay, I'm going to start my metronome. I'm going to do this first line here. Feel free to listen and then try it with me and then we'll kind of go down the line. All right, my metronome starting. Should be able to hear it now. My turn, then yours. Here I go. One, two, three, and four. Now you do it on the video. By the way, make sure you're recording. If you're not, go ahead and pause and then start it up. Your turn. Clap without me. Good. I hope you did okay. It should have been one, two, three, and four. Okay. So feel the beat. Tap your foot. Nod your head. Now we're going to go down the line. We're going to start here. Um, wait for me to pause in between each line, okay? So we'll do this one, and then I'll give you, I'll tell you a wait, and then I'll count you back in for the next line down, all right? So this one right here. Get ready to do it with me. You should clap, or you should say the numbers, or do both. Get ready. One, two, ready, and go. One and two, three, and a four. Get ready for the next. Ready, and here you go. One, two, three, four, and all we're doing right now is warming up our rhythm chops. That's all we're doing. Okay, now we're getting ready for this line. Get ready, 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 go. One and two and three, four, e and up. Those needed to be fast. Last line, get ready, ready, go. One, two, three, four. Remember the dashes are for if it's a long note, right? Which is why my voice kind of like elided it together. Yeah? Okay, let's move on and let's practice just a little bit more. Now these look more complicated, but we can decipher them easily. When in doubt, start with one. This is actually going to be beat two, but it's in the parentheses. And then that, of course, that means this is an and, right? Because how do we do eighth notes? This is an eighth note. We do one and two and three and four and. A quarter rest gets the beat but it's silent, so I need to put it in parentheses, right? Which means that what comes after three? Four. Four, E, and, uh, because that's how we do 16th notes. 16th notes have two of these bars going across the top, but of course this one needs to be in parentheses, okay? So let me do it first, and then you do it after me. All right, I'll do it nice and slow. Ready, and here I go. One, two, and, Four E and. Okay, try it with me. You can say whisper the two and whisper the three, just because it's easier to like feel it if you whisper it. Okay, get ready. Try it with me. Go. One, two, and three. Four E and. Oh. Okay, a little bit complicated, but you just have to like feel those beats still, even though they're silent. So let's look at this next bit. It should be easy to start out with. 16th notes, 1 E and a. 2 E, how do I know it's 2 E? Because these are 16th notes, right? So I have to follow the same pattern as I did here. This is going to be and 3 E and a. It's a 16th rest because it has two flags. See that? Four E and these are the same pattern twice. Four E and uh, so I do the same thing twice. Okay, a little bit faster now. Try it with me this time. Are you ready? 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 Go. One E and a two E three E and four E and. So notice how it, this should feel like three E and a four E and a, but I just don't say the uh. Okay, maybe a little bit slower. Maybe like da. Up. Ready, ready, try it and go. One E and a two E, three E, four E, uh. Right, and I don't say the uh. Four E and a, three E and four E and. Sorry, I think I did that wrong. Okay, let's go down to the bottom. One and two in parentheses. Three and four. 
How do I know that they're ands, that they're plus signs? Because these are eighth notes, and that's what goes with the division of eighth notes, right? Let's keep going. When in doubt, start with one. It's a silent one, though. This is B2. And a half rest, remember, looks like a hat. This is above the line, so that means it's 3 dash 4 because any long note needs a dash symbol, right? And it's parentheses because it's quiet. Same thing here. We start with 1 because you always have to. That's worth 2 beats because it's a hat. Same thing. And then this is 3 and 4 and. Be careful, these are not 16th notes. If they were 16th notes, they would have another line. Okay, so let's go and do all three of these in a row without stopping, okay? So like laser focus, pay very close attention. Get ready. Actually, I'm gonna make this a little bit slower and okay. Feel the beat, nod your head. I'll tell you when to start. Ready, 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 go. One and shh, three and shh. Wait, sorry, I'm gonna give you a breather before we do the next, okay? Get ready, ready, and shh, two, shh. So we actually only have one note in that entire beat, right? Okay, let's do this next one. It starts with two beats of rest. Ready, 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 go. Shh, three and four and, right? Okie doke. Looking at our rhythm tree, I want you to pay attention only to the bottom. It goes one e and a, two e and a, three e and a, four e and a. So usually we group them in groups of four, right? Sometimes we don't. Sometimes we see patterns like this and like this. And there's an easy word to remember how they sound. This one sounds like hamburger, also known as long, short, short. So it sounds like this. Hamburger, 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 hamburger. Hamburger, 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 hamburger. So whenever you see that, it's an eighth note at the beginning and it's grouped together with two sixteenth notes, right? And then down here, it's flipped around. It's backwards and it sounds like Pokemon, 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 Pokemon. So instead of being long, short, short, long, short, short, it's short, short, long, short, short, long, short, short, long, short, short, long. Pokemon, 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 Pokemon. All right. Practice that with me. Let's do the hamburger first. Just say four of them in a row. One, two, ready, go. Hamburger, 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 hamburger. Because the stress is on the ham, right? And now let's do four of the Pokemons in a row. Get ready, it needs to be short, short, long. Ready, here you go. Pokemon, 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 Pokemon. So right here, I see a hamburger. I see a Pokemon, because the fast ones are in the front, which means it's Pokemon, Pokemon. I see a Pokemon here too. I see a Pokemon here too. I'm just paying attention to what they look like. If the 16th notes are on the front half of the little group, that means that's the short, short, long, short, short, long. And then these ones are the hamburger ones. All right, so practice these with me. I want you to repeat after me, okay? So I should be able to hear it on your video. My turn, then yours. Let me do this one first in the top corner. My turn, then yours. It goes, ba, ba, hamburger rest. Your turn, here you go. Ba, ba, hamburger rest. And I whispered the rest that time. Okay, keep up. Let's do the next one. This is a Pokemon one here, so get ready for that. Okay, you're repeating after me. My turn, and here I go. Ba, sh, ba, Pokemon. Your turn, ready and say it. Ba, sh, ba, Pokemon. Pokemon. Remember, how do I know? It's because the double bar, the 16th notes, are on the front. And over here, they're on the second half. So this one's hamburger. This one's Pokemon. Okay, I have two Pokemons in a row and then a long note. Okay, I'm going to do this on a ch. I encourage you to do the same. My turn, then yours. One, two, here I go. Ch -ch 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 -ch. Did you hear it sound like Pokemon? 
your turn, and here you go. Good job. Okay, so for this one, we have two Pokemons, and then we have two hamburgers. So make sure you switch it up. We're just going to say it on the words. I know they're silly, but we're going to say Pokemon, Pokemon, hamburger, hamburger. You ready? Try it with me. So this one, do it at the same time as me. Get ready, ready, here we go. Pokemon, Pokemon, hamburger, hamburger. Now try it, ch ing, ready, and ch. Okay, you hanging in there? All right, you can stop the video now. That was good practice.